Yo bros, welcome to another weekend league video on my channel. If you've seen the last episode, you will know that we finished gold one for the very first weekend league we did. It was my record, my best ever, 25 wins, 15 losses, so a difference of 10. It's not the best you will see out there on YouTube, but for me it's a great accomplishment. I don't have all the time in the world for the game, as you know. I keep repeating myself, but it was my best ever. On FIFA 17 I never got this far. So I invested big on the team this time. As you can see, we got Aubameyang on the front, and this is the greatest addition. He is amazing. He scores more goals than he plays games. And that's enough said. And then I went with a German hybrid with the Liga Nos, a little bit of Liga Nos. And the main reason was last week in league, I think my weak point was the defense. So with Socrates and Boateng. Anyway, enough talking about the team. Let's get to the games. Do you think I got better than Gold 1? So let's get into the games. I'm going to show you the last nine games of the weekend league i played the other 31 on my own i didn't record them and at this point we were up 19 wins 13 losses we were looking okay not great but okay and here obama and this is what he does best find space run out muscle the other guy and even if it's really far away he will he has a lot of shot power and precision, he will score from anywhere. And what's the best partner for Obama Yang? It's our hero, Seydu Dumbia. He just plays so good, I can't believe you can get him for like a thousand coins. Just because he's from the Liga Nos and no one really uses the Liga Nos. Anyway, this special free kick. He goes 2-2. I thought I was going to win this game, but he came back. And I considered so many goals with this type of free kick, it's annoying. I want to learn to do it myself, so if you know how to do it, just type on the comments how to do it, and I'll try the next time, but yeah, this game sadly we lost. As I said, very frustrating, I was, I thought I, the, the game was on my hands and I let it go, so it's very dangerous in the league, weekend league to get comfortable, people will come back, and here, we come again, came up against this weekend, this Premier League team. And I'm sick of seeing the same guys everywhere. Everyone uses Martial. Bakayoko is literally in every team. Gabriel Jesus as well. It feels like I'm playing the same team again and again. And this weekend league was so annoying because there was this weird thing happening where we call it the kickoff boost. So when you score a goal or the other guy scores a goal, it's like the other the defending players turn to mud, turn to shit, and there's so many goals that when you consider score a goal right after, like here, he scored and then I scored. It was the most dangerous time of the game. So I even stopped celebrating my goals because I knew that it was a very dangerous situation after I had to, you know, foul him or because it's so dangerous. But we're three one up. And this Sterling just runs through my defense and Martial gets it in the net. Little, literally, this could be any game of the weekend league. This keeps happening, Martial, Jesus. But anyway, here's an original team with two silver strikers. I was very refreshed by this. And those two strikers are good. I I think it's Sao. Sao. The other guy, I can't remember his name, but they're like 90, 90 speed. They're really good, but not as good as Aubameyang and Dumbia and 10 minutes until the end and we're up and of course he scores and there's there was just no easy games this was a, this was a hard run it was, I, I think this one was harder than the last weekend league if we do it if we finish as well as we did last time I don't know but look at this goal by my super sub Elio Nussi, this guy has 5 star skills, 87 pace, no one uses him in the first team because he's from Norway and he's from FC Basel, so it's not hard to, to connect with him, it's, it's impossible to fit him in a team, but as a super sub he works really great, and look at this, what I just said about the kickoff boost, he scored and I scored and he scored and you know it was in the 80th minute and we, it was just 1-0. And, and then it's like everyone scores every time they try. Anyway, on extra time, I Aubameyang uh, puts us up front, but then what happens? Saved by the bar. 
Oh yeah, sorry, uh, I was confused. This game, I, I, I forgot to record the beginning. And this was a crazy game, I remember it so well. Both me and the other guy, we were having so many chances, clear chances of goal. And the keepers were saving everything, or you know, the strikers were failing easy stuff that otherwise they would score. Look at this, fail fast. It was incredible. Nothing went in, even the guy got two penalties and I saved it. And we kept attacking and attacking and trying to score. I even tried to sweat it, but not even with sweat, the ball just wouldn't go in. Not in corners, not in open play. <sighs> so frustrating. But then, Jelson Martins gets it in and I thought, you know what, there, there's no way there will be more goals on this game. And I thought, okay, I'll go ultra defending and I will secure the win. And I kept failing goals. I kept failing goals and failing goals. Nothing will go in. It was both me and the other guy. Nothing will go in. This was the strangest game ever. And in the last minute, I finished my chance to kill the game two times in the bar, three times. And then this happens. Taking too long, but you can guess it. Wow, it's in the 90th minute for a very long time. I didn't notice that. Anyway, after 10 minutes of extra time, the guy scored and we were 1-1. And then I got a red card. Um, yeah, it was a red card for Goretzka, I think. And then out of all the people, Hui Costa kills us and then he still gets another one. So this game was a crazy, crazy game. And we lost, we could have won it easily. So 21 wins, we got goal two. Now we need just four more to get to, to our goal. I mean, elite, we can't get elite anymore. But it would be great if we could get gold one like last week because the rewards are really good. And Aubameyang, did you see that the guy just outruns everyone, out muscles everyone. He has three star skills. Eh. But then is a uh, weak foot for stars and again this free kick so annoying so freaking annoying as is this kit again i'm pl see i'm playing against the same kit again by the way i'm using the Werder Bremen kit i liked the club when i was a kid like when i was what 12 or something i did this uh, it wasn't even on fifa it was on pro evolution soccer and I played with Werder Bremen a lot, both on fifth, uh, both on pass and on football manager. It was like my German club, and I think this this kit seems awesome. I don't like uh, Sporting's uh, second kit, the black one. I think it looks kind of ugly. What the goal from Aubameyang? So I decided to go to this one and pretend it's Sporting's second kit. I swear, if, if we had this second kit, kit in real life, I wish we could play it every game. That's, I like the German league for this. Uh, in, in kits, they change their kits every season. They keep their colors, they keep their identity, but the kits it keeps refreshing. Where in other leagues, we, you know, not so much. But we lost that game, and I lost all hope. And I, I even thought about stopping recording because we, we needed four wins out of four, and it was being so frustrating. And believe me, I was raging, I was red, I was shouting. Embarrassing, but I, you know, I, I thought I missed on gold one, and that sucks. So I came to this game more relaxed, and it's weird because from this on, from this point on, it seemed like EA gave me easy opponents, and then there was weird stuff happening in game. They didn't feel like normal games. Sometimes I felt like I was being helped. So, like the whole weekend league, I was feeling like the other guy was being helped. On this occasion, it felt like I was the one being uh, benefited. But anyway, four wins out of four games. Can we do it? Of course, we have this annoying free kick, but this time it doesn't go in. But we have a penalty, and we were 3 nil up. And then, <sighs> did we waste? No, remember the trick, the penalty trick I told you on the other episode? If not, I will remind you just in case, maybe you're new in the channel. But when you're scoring a penalty, when you're doing the run, if you're pointing to one side, your player will like look to that side. So you can see where the, the guy is pointing. 
so you can guess the way the penalties go. The thing is some people know about this and they will point at one side and then shoot to the other or point one side and then shoot middle and anyway <laughs> here I tried to look to one side and then I just failed the penalty horribly with quick question and it's an exciting game at least I wasn't you know I was very relaxed I literally didn't care if I win or lost because I honestly didn't believe we could win the 4 out of 4 uh, and we will win this game so we need 3 wins out of 3 games it's crazy can we get it and here the classic FIFA new goal where from a penalty uh, from sorry a goal kick or a free kick right near your goal you just press X and yeah, the striker gets the ball and scores oh but my yang I swear this guy is so good, hat trick, everyone is crazy on the stand, so 3 games, we need 3 wins to get the gold one, what do you think guys, can we get it? Again, uh, on this game I forgot to, to check the other, what to go from Rui Costa, I found that Rui Costa, if you try to finesse it, the ball doesn't go powerful enough, if you try to uh, arc to and shoot with Rui Costa, uh, there's no here is it will just go straight to the keeper but if you get space and you do the, the special kind of shot which is L2 and shoot you will like shoot with the outside of his foot or do a really nice looking shot and sometimes you will score absolute bangers so 2-1 it's looking good and Hui Costa again he scores so many goals as a cam I will do it like a spoiler after this weekend league I changed my tactic uh, because of the patch I will speak about it in the next video but I'm playing Hui Costa as a CM and it's like he, he disappeared from the game I he's not on the goals he doesn't score anymore but you know the week the the team is working better that way but yeah I missed this tactic with Hui Costa being so so powerful and this game was so crazy. Remember what I said about the weird stuff, strange things happening during these games. Uh, this one was, was crazy. It was just so easy to score and impossible to defend. I had no idea if I was going to win this game or lose. Let's see what happened there. I mean, it's, wow. This was definitely the worst goal of the whole weekend league. 5-4, what a crazy scoreline, and it's not over yet because Rui Costa made an hat-trick. Aubameyang did it in the last game, and this was Rui Costa's time, and he goes to the opponent. <laughs> Look at that, it's like, if this happened in real life, you go to the enemy supporters and you celebrate like that, you'll get punched in the face or something. Anyway, 6-5, uh, I was nervous because... The 6-6 six, school six cool happened actually was attacking right there, but it didn't happen and it was the time for Quick Costa to take the ball home. So, the last two games we need two wins. Uh, we play again, the, again uh, against that inform Zaha. This guy is a beast. He's a devil. Him and Gabriel Jesus together uh, or separate, you know, I just hate those two guys. I can't remember if it was in this game. I guess we will discover right now but I had a lot of trouble against this Zaha and I was going to yeah it wasn't this game definitely because I paused the game oh yeah now I remember this is crazy last two games I need two wins so on this game I paused the game to change my tactics I do it every time as you know and he quits and then on the second game the game starts and it's Dumbia it could be Aubameyang they, they kind of look alike sometimes and they score so many goals like this. Anyway, we go 1-0. And I'm so nervous because this is it. If I win it, I get gold 1. If I lose, we're out. And then look, counter-attack, super dangerous. Hazard on his own is going to score. And it disconnected. He disconnected when he was going to score. Maybe if he scored and he disconnected after, we will get a draw. And then we'll have to do another game and I will lose. If he didn't disconnect, maybe he will score and then he will win the game, but he didn't. And I was so happy. I was like, oh, what the fuck? I was like jumping on the house I because I lost, la all, oh, da, 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 da. I lost all hope. And it was four games where I needed to win every single one of them. And I win the first two against really shit opponents in a very weird game. And then on the last two, one guy quits after... I scored one goal and you know 
he could have worn it, it wasn't bad, I remember. And the second one, I guess it was luck, but I, I scored and <laughs> as he was going to score, he disconnected and I win, so maybe this was the EA gods giving me what I deserved. Did I though? I don't know, I didn't play great, but yeah, gold won. We're still on our way to Elite. We will see the rewards in a new video soon. Anyway, two weekend leagues, two good ones. I'm happy. I will see you next time. Bye bye!